Hey everybody, you already know who it is. It is your boy Thesis and we are back once again for another video. And this time we have Native Instruments that has released another update to Guitar Rig 7 Pro. So I'm really excited to go over the brand new updates they have with it. I do have a beat. Yeah, we're gonna have some fun. So you guys keep it locked, stay tuned. All right, so let's talk about what's brand new in Guitar Rig Pro. So basically you have new IC amp, you have a super fast 100, you have a reverb delight, you have a bass range, a AC box XV, a cabinet impulse response loader. You also have new effects and rack components. So you have a brand new one called the Loop Machine Pro and I did play around with it. So I will go over, uh, you know, briefly just to show you how it works. It's really cool. It gives you some funky, uh, different type of ways that you can play around with your own sounds and make it a loop and all types of stuff. So, but you also have a noise machine which packs sounds of like classic gears like the tape cassettes, like VHS tapes. So you would think that it would be like an RC20 killer I'm not gonna say it's that, but it is something along that range that you will have fun with when it comes to making lo-fi sounds, which is really, really dope. You also have a tape wobble that will capture any of those analog tape machine effects, and you also have a vintage vibrato. So that's really cool. And the last thing is that you have new pedals. So you have a color pedal, the Screamer Deluxe, the Chainsaw, the IV Stomp, and the Seattle Fuzz. Now, what I want to do is I want to go over just the beat itself. I did save a couple of presets, but I have a preset here. And this initial preset is one called Lost Vibes. Let's check out the beat. So whenever I thought about guitar rig, I always thought about automatically, you know, playing guitar and stuff like that. But I noticed through production, especially through the years that you can use amps, you can use different type of characters within those effects to bring out different sounds. And that's one thing I like about guitar rig. Let's go through some of the actual new stuff that I talked about. Now, the way that you say, for instance, if you want to curate some of these presets and you want to save them, as you see on the side here, you go, you left click and you can go from fuchsia to orange you have other presets that you can go through which are import sources effects types characters amplifiers genres and you have different artists that have made their own presets to this that you can try out on some of your sounds which is really really cool so the loop player will be under your tools and then you will hit loop machine pro right so here's the loop machine pro which is really really fun it's really fun so i'm a single out the melody that I played, and then I'm going to play it, and then you'll see how it starts to make its own type of funky little things based off the presets and things that you have. So let's check it out. Now what I'm gonna do is, as this is playing, I'm gonna go ahead and then set the actual loop. It's just that simple. You can speed it up times two. You can drop it down half. Now you have a record length where you can go. It's free from one to 16 bars. Uh, let's stop that. <laughs> 
All right, so I deleted this, and now we're back to the original Lost Vibes. So the Lost Vibes is one of the presets that I came across that has a lo-fi feel to it. And as you can see, you can manipulate, change any of those presets as usual. You add a side chain to the supercharger. Um, I do want to play around and just show you just an example of you know the actual sounds that can come from the actual preset. So I picked four just to listen so you guys can get a comparison to it. So let's check it out. So uh, yeah, basically that's that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you the new things that they have. Uh, one of my favorite things was the Loop Machine Pro. If you guys have this, please make sure that you go and get the update. If you do not, please make sure that you drop down to the link in the description, go cop this. It is definitely a must have if you support anything that Native Instrument do. Trust and believe me, it is a must grab. And another thing, if you guys have not subscribed already, why haven't you go down drop down to the link and subscribe to the page like and comment this video and uh yeah let's talk about it let's see what you guys think about the new update to guitar rig pro 7 so that's pretty much it for me but you guys already know who it is it is your boy thesis peace